Broadcast studios are changing how they distribute video signals inside the studio. No longer are they using point-to-point -point wiring, instead they're using network-based connectivity. Essentially what that means is that all the devices in studio and all the cameras and all the monitors and things are plugged directly into a common a TCP IP network. Likewise, all the devices in control room, the switcher, the monitors, the recorders, etc., they are connected to the, to the same network cloud. Same thing in control room too. Now in cloud-based topology, if you want to route signal from camera one and studio one, to switcher one and controller one, you do it through software. You have what's called a routing table. So in studio one, camera one, it has a routing table that says, I'm sending my output to uh, control room one, switcher one, input one. And likewise, a matching entry is made in the control room switcher saying that for control room one, switcher two, input or switch it one input one we are going to receive our signal from studio oops, studio one uh, camera one now if i want to add camera one to control room uh, two the switcher in control room two it's very easy the first thing i do is i make a routing table entry in the studio camera saying that in addition to sending your signal to studio control room one we're also going to send it to control room two, switcher two, input two. And likewise, in the switcher, in control room two, we make a matching entry that says input two, get our control room two, switcher two, input two, gets its input from studio one and um, camera. camera one. Likewise, if there was, say, a production lounge, and there was a lobby, and they each had monitors in them, we could say, Studio One, Camera One, send your output to uh, production lounge one. Uh, monitor one. Uh, there would be a similar table that says my input comes from studio one, camera one. And likewise, we would make a routing table entry for the lobby saying send it to lobby one, uh, monitor one. And in the lobby, the monitor would say uh, receive your input from studio one, camera one. So in this model, adding new outputs or re, re, uh, redirecting the signal from one place to another becomes a simple software change typically done through a, a web-based GUI interface. This allows for lots of flexibility inside the production studio because you're also connecting advanced equipment like uh, character generators and, um, and video servers and graphics engines and effects engines and they're all in the network. And so if you want to grab another effects engine, if it's available in a different studio, you just simply set up some routing table entries that say, send this signal through that effects engine, and then take the output and bring it into my input channel. So cloud-based network topology as the backbone for a production studio allows for a greater, a huge degree of freedom in terms of how the studio as a whole is configured. Not just simply a studio and a control room, but all the studios, all the control rooms, all the various monitors in that studio.